And we now welcome in Bo Hostler. Bo, you won the Western Amateur. How does it feel to do something that Ben Crenshaw and Justin Leonard have done in the past? Yeah, it's a pretty incredible feeling. I really didn't know, actually, that, that they had won the tournament, so I saw their names on the trophy uh, a couple days ago, so it was pretty interesting. Um, and I know that it's obviously quite an honor to win that tournament because it has a lot of history and some pretty incredible past champions uh, like the ones you just mentioned. So what was working specifically with your game? Well, this whole summer I've been uh, I've been playing really consistent, really solid. I feel like everything in my game has been, um, you know, up to par. I haven't really had any weaknesses, which has been nice. I put a lot of work in this this uh, spring, and I know, you know, being in Austin, I have a lot of people that really care about my future and my career, and it's nice to uh, know that their hard work as well as mine has started to pay off a little bit. Seven. Longhorns made the field of the Western Amateur. So what did you learn about what the future holds for this group? Uh, yeah, our team's going to be, um, I think, one of the best in the country this year. Um, you know, we, have, we have some excellent freshmen coming in, and Doug Gim and Scotty Scheffler, as well as Taylor Funk, who will begin his eligibility here in the fall, um, to go along with you know, countless good players, I think, on our team um, prior to them coming in. So I think it's... Uh, you know, a step in the right direction. I Coach Fields and Coach Murphy and now uh, Coach Hebert have done a great job recruiting new talent um, as well as helping us to become successful while we're here and, and get better as, as golfers and as well as as people. Well, Bo, congratulations on the big-time win at the Western Amateur. Thanks for catching up with us, and we really do appreciate the time as always. Of course. Of course. Thank you so much.